Hey, welcome back to the cabin, everyone. Hey, today I'm going to show you how I did my air conditioning system. The way this is going to work is we're going to use the geothermal mass of the earth, which in my area, after about four feet, the earth stays a constant temperature of 52, 53 degrees. I went ahead and put these pipes in the ground at uh, eight foot. I put a hundred foot in the ground. So what I did is the air gets pushed out of the out of the pipe, and it goes. I, would, I did a big loop all the way out here, as you can see in the picture. And we're using the earth as a heat exchanger. So when the air comes back, you know it's it's cooled it down. So your air that you're putting back in your cabin is usually about 58 degrees. The idea I got with this is uh, some of the homes out in New Mexico where it gets blistering hot, uh, they, they do the same thing, but they have these tubes that go through these large mounds of earth. Um, but they're sucking outside air, and I thought, you know, why don't you just recycle air? You know, the outside of my cabin's uh, made out of metal, as anybody in Texas will tell you. In the summertime, this stuff gets hotter than Satan's ass. So this right here isn't going to be how this looks. I just wanted to show you this uh, before I cover it because later this is going to have stone going all the way over it. These pipes will be insulated. I'm going to do some cement art. Uh, this is actually, these will end up being some trees that go up the side of the cabin and branch out. Uh, so it'll be really neat to, to see that. The motor that I'm using on this is a six inch exhaust fan. The back of this fan has a shaft about like this. It fits directly into your, your ductwork. As you can tell, it's not very loud. This motor pulls uh, one tenth of an amp, so anybody off grid amps really matter. So this doesn't hardly use any electricity whatsoever. I left the other end open over here so you can see. Uh, I've just now, this is the first time I've got it all up and running. And right now, I mean, it's 97 degrees outside, and this is already uh, cooling it down in here. I mean, the air coming out of it is really cool. For those of you who are wondering if you, how you can control this with a thermostat, you can. Uh, they sell these thermostats. All they do is they plug into an outlet, and then you plug whatever you want to control into this. It's got a uh, temperature probe. So you're going to set this up there, and you can, you can program this to whatever temperature you want. And then when it reaches temperature, it kills the power to the fan. So if you live off grid and you're trying to find a uh, more efficient way of cooling down your cabin or your tiny home or anything like that, give this a try because this this is working really great. This is the first day I've had this running. Uh, I'll do a follow-up video after after I get everything done outside, everything's insulated, uh, and I'll show you how well it's been working since then. Uh, appreciate y'all watching. Y'all have a blessed day.